Welcome to V8 DXP. Today we are at the launch event and first look of the 2020 Toyota Corolla in Dubai. The Corolla Hybrid, which has been showcased over here, features a lower, wider and a more aggressive styling that makes it stand apart from all the competitors out there. This is the first time ever that a Corolla is coming in its hybrid variant. And given the rising fuel costs and lower cost of ownership that Toyota owners demand, the Toyota Corolla can offer on a full tank of gas, a thousand kilometer range. Now one of the myths that was debunked was this is the kind of a hybrid that does not need to be plugged in or does not need to be charged. It is the kind of a hybrid that automatically charges on its own with technology such as regenerative braking, braking and such. It created a lot of buzz and a lot of people were very excited to see what the car has to do. And one of the things that, the, that really stood out was in terms of how good the car is styled. It is really a very, very well styled vehicle uh, and it gives you very good quality of fit and finish as well. Let's move on to the interiors and you can see that the Toyota has completely changed the interiors for the 2020 hybrid and it's a much premium looking interior that you'd expect for a car. And given the price point of this car that starts at 89,000 dirhams, that's really not a lot, but you get all the quality stuff. You have a very good infotainment touchscreen with a dedicated volume knob and also a tuner. And this also supports Apple CarPlay uh, and all of that such as well. So you've got that technology going on. You've got a you've got a rather basic looking instrument cluster in the set with an RPM with an RPM gauge, and you've got your uh, speedometer on that side as well. And you've also got your uh, cruise controls or your media controls on the left, and your uh, cruise controls on the right, which is standard. Uh, a couple of blank switches over here, maybe because this is not the top of the line premium version that was on display, but uh, on the top of the line you do get a full LCD unit as well. Initial driving impressions of the car is great as well. Uh, it doesn't feel like it's an hybrid, it feels like just another normal car. Uh, it's got a very nice steering wheel which is electronic and it's really amazing to drive in around city. And you can see that this is the top of the line variant so it has the electronic console at the back in terms of your RPM and speedometer. Uh, and you can see that it also has a, a wireless charging port that's given over here that you can place your phones and charge. On the rear over here, you also have drive mode selectors, your traction control and your EV mode selector, which lets you choose between different variations. And uh, overall, you've got a great build quality of everything else uh, that's included over here. And uh, good feel for the tactile for the air conditioning unit as well. And great visibility all around is uh, what we could see from initial instructions. This is obviously the monitor that shows you your engine and your battery power that you're using. The initial impressions for the Corolla are obviously great and uh, I think that it's a very exciting car that Toyota has launched especially at this price point and this market that's now getting more and more hybrid cars into, into the arena. Uh, it'll be very interesting to see how this car competes against all the other competitors and what the real world gas mileage for this car is going to be which is, one of, which is going to be one of the major selling points for this car. Uh, stay tuned for more video as this is just a preview of the car and uh, once we get your cars on the test drive as well then we'll be looking forward to a full review. Consider subscribing to the channel if you like the content and I will see you soon.